it look like I'm actually live once more. Welcome to another live stream. And if you're watching this on the replay, welcome just the same. My name is Oral McKenzie. And in this live stream, I want to share with you a guide not to quit YouTube. And this channel, I will teach you how to grow your YouTube channel and help you solve your everyday tech problems. You know I like sharing my knowledge with you because I strongly believe that knowledge is power and I want to empower you all. So if it's your first time here, i love for you to subscribe to the channel, hit the like button and guys, share out the link for this stream to your friends and family so we can have an awesome time. So um, just before I get started, I want to do the housekeeping to actually tell you guys how this stream will be actually running. So what I'll be doing, I'll be presenting to you guys first on the topic that I have and as soon as I finish the presentation, I will jump in the chat and take your questions. And if anybody is, is actually interested in channel review, I'll also be doing that. But just before I get started, let me jump in the chat and give some pre persons that are already in the chat some shout out. And guys, in the chat, let me know if you're hearing me properly and if the audio is good. So in the chat, I can see we have Crafty Croft. Are you still in the building? How are you doing? And we have Moya from Belize. We're glad to have you. Welcome to the family. Karaji, of course, is in the live. And I want to say a warm welcome back to you, Karaji. We have been missing you a lot on the streams. And we are just glad that you are back. And we hope we'll have an awesome stream. Who are the other persons that are in the chat? Just say something in the chat so I can see you. And I can actually give you a shout out. And guys, what I want you to do while I'm presenting, I want you to think about your questions and have them ready. So as soon as I'm finished with the presentation, I'll take all your questions and we, have, we can have a discussion on this live. So with no further ado, I'm just going to get started right now. So let me actually share with you something before I actually get started. So guys, just before I get started on what I have for you, today I was actually watching um, an interview that Robert Blake did he was interviewing this guy known as um i think his name is john professor from front page tech and you know what the guy from front page tech was just about to quit youtube when his channel blew up there there let, let me actually show you guys i think they are like um something like in fact there are 45,390 subscriber now just um about one month ago he was about to quit YouTube because he was like on YouTube for like five years and it wasn't working for him. He was like um, at almost 20,000 subscribers and he was just wasn't working out. And he was he decided that he was going to quit. And look at what happened in one month time. He, he went through that curve and now his channel is blown up. Also, this not an awesome YouTuber. I don't know if you guys is aware or you guys have known or you ever watched any video from his channel. His name is Philip DeFranco. His channel is at like 5,729,782 subscribers. Just about when he was actually wanting to quit YouTube and somebody encouraged him not to, that's when his channel blew up. If he had quit YouTube, he wouldn't be at 5 million subscribers today. So I'm going to share with you guys in this live stream the YouTube curve. And how you can actually navigate your way through it a guide not to quit so that's what we're going to be talking about so let me see what you guys are seeing in the chat and then i'm going to actually bring up my slideshow with the presentation that i have for you guys so um carrie is saying the struggles can be real sometimes never give up for real these guys are perfect example most definitely so let me actually help you guys through that not to give up so I have my presentation right here and I'm just going to turn it into a slideshow. So I'm going to begin from the current slide. And you guys let me know in the chat if my face is in the way any at all or if I'm hiding up, I'm covering up anything. But I doubt it very much. I doubt it pretty much. So we should be cool. So let me start. So the first slide is saying a guide not to give up on YouTube dreams with social media tech TV. That's what we're dealing with today. So let me bring up my first slide. So my first slide is where I actually draw the YouTube curve for you and I'm going to explain it to you and show you how to navigate through it. 
So this what we have right here is the YouTube curve in what is what look like um, a chart, um, a graph. So on this side of the graph, we are, I have three things labeled. So right down here on the left one um, corner, um, I'm wondering if you guys are seeing this properly. Let me know in the chat. I'm going to check back in the chat to ensure that my face is not covering up everything, anything, because I want you guys to see this properly. So let me know in the chat if you're seeing everything on the screen. So let me actually hop back in the chat to ensure that everything is cool. Um, are you guys seeing the graph properly? Am I covering up anything? Um, let me know in the chat. I'm not seeing anybody saying anything in the chat. But we should be good with the graph. So, um, oh, Kari J is saying we're seeing everything. So, let, all right, so that's cool. So let me continue and actually show you guys what I'm talking about. So we're ready and we're good to go. So this is the, the graph for the YouTube curve. And we're going to talk about how you can navigate your way through it. So on this side, you will have right here where um, you feel good. And right here, you, you, you know, in fact, right here should be that you feel bad. Because this is the lowest point. So I make a mistake right here. And right here, you should have feel okay right in the middle right up here and up here you should have where you feel great and right here is the timing to it so let us go through it so when you just started youtube you're excited you're, you're all excited about it and you think it's gonna be just a walk in the park and your your channel is just gonna blow away so you're actually seeing growth you're getting views and all that stuff and you're saying hey this is cool then, then you actually go to the honeymoon um, stage where everything seems to be fine. Everything is just looking awesome and nice. Your channel is actually going up. You're seeing that growth. And then all of a sudden, you're not seeing that growth. You're seeing where you're going down. You start going down the hill. So the uncertainty start. You're not certain about this thing anymore. Then you start to lose confidence and you, the curve keep on going down. You start getting confused. Right after that, you start getting confused. You're wondering if you're doing the right thing. You're wondering what else should you should do. And you're just not getting it. And the views and the subscriber and the watch time and everything keep on going down. And it goes down with the confusion until you get to the part where you're actually depressed. Depression start. And it go all the way down to that dip where it is like you hit that plateau and right here is where most creators quit they quit right here that is where most creators quit on youtube but guess what my granny always say the darkest part of the night is just before dawn you know what you mean by that just before daylight out when you're going to see all the glory it seems as if nothing is going on and it is the darkest part so Transfer that to your YouTube channel. The darkest or the hardest part is just before you get that breakthrough on YouTube. When you hit that plateau, when you're down in the curve right here. You're down in the curve and you're feeling depressed and you feel like you want to quit. But that is when you're not supposed to quit. Because right after that, you have to start accepting it and say, hey. So accept and start right there. If you don't quit, you'll start accepting it and say, hey. This thing is not as easy as I think. It's really hard, but guess what? I'm going to put in the work, and I'm actually going to see my way through. So after you start accepting that this thing is not as easy as you think, then you're going to start exploring. You're going to try to explore other things to see what's working and to see what's not working and stuff like that. You start exploring things on YouTube. And after you start exploring, you're going to start testing things. To see what work and to see what don't work. And then after you test some things and they're working. And then you figure this thing out now. And you say yes this is how it work. You're going to actually gain that new confidence. So this is actually how the YouTube curve work. Believe it or not. And if you talk to those big YouTubers. They will tell you that this is exactly how the YouTube curve work. So I want to help you guys. Um to go through this curve but i don't want to help you guys right at this part here the excitement the honeymoon the uncertainty the losing the confidence the confusion and the depression and the quitting part i don't want to help you guys with that what i want to help you guys with is from right here 
where you start accepting, you're exploring, you're testing, and you're getting up there. And Karjay is a perfect example of this. I think she start accepting YouTube and how it works now. And she actually confessed to me that even though she um, disagree with me many times on the live stream, she start accepting some things now and she's going to start exploring and start doing it. So I think Kari J is right at this point now on YouTube. She's, I think she's right here. Oh, I'm sorry about that. I was actually playing with the mouse. So I think she's right. She's right here on YouTube. For my channel, I think I'm right here. I'm testing things and all that stuff. I'm just before I'm going to get that breakthrough. So that's how the curve works. But I have some additional information for you on how to actually get from here to here. But I want to I wanna jump in the chat really quick and see what you guys are saying in the chat. And then I'm going to actually share those type of information with you. Uh, so um, J is saying, seeing everything, you're fine. We have like four persons watching, or the persons that are watching, let me know in the chat. And if you have any questions, start thinking about your questions because as soon as I'm finished presenting, I'm going to hop in the chat to answer all your questions. Karji Live is saying, I am accepting it for real. Thank God you have get to the stage that you start accepting. So I'm, I'm perfectly correct about where you're at now. You start accepting and that's really cool. So... We're going to get deeper into it now to show you how to actually navigate through this YouTube thing after you start accepting. The persons that are watching, let me know in the chat who are the persons that are watching, who we have with us in the house. Let me know what persons we have with us in the house so we can actually um, interact with you and let this be a conversation. So I'm going to move on to show you how to navigate through the curve starting from the accepting um, portion. So I'm actually going to turn back this into a slideshow from the current slide and then um, I want to scroll to the next slide. So what you want to do is that you want to have a bigger purpose for your YouTube channel. Other than just um, the subscribers, the fame and all that, you want to have a bigger purpose for your YouTube channel. And that is what will motivate you and keep you going. So for on my channel, I strongly believe that knowledge is power and I want to empower you all. So that's my big purpose for my YouTube channel. Empowering people, sharing my knowledge with them to empower them because we all can agree that knowledge is power. And the next thing that I have on the slide for you is that when I, what actually keep me motivated most of the time is when I teach someone something and they get it, I feel I have won. It gives me like goosebumps. For example, when I teach Kari J something or any other one of my subscribers anywhere on my channel, and they actually commented and said, awesome tutorial, I like it and I learn, that give me that good inner feeling. I feel like I've won a million dollars. So that's my purpose and you have to find out on your channel a bigger purpose for your channel other than just the numbers if the numbers is what you you're here for you're going to get depressed and you're going to quit don't worry too much about the numbers on your channel the numbers will come over time if your goal is to be um to be popular or to make money there are lots of other places that you can make money much easier than youtube believe me trust me in that one so if that's your goal you're going to get but up if you're not getting that I mean, if you're not reaching that goal so you have to have a bigger purpose than just the subscriber be famous to get on YouTube so let me know what you guys think about everything that I'm sharing you guys in the chat I'll be getting in the chat as soon as I finish the presentation the number two slide that I have for you guys is that you want to surround yourself with people that have done it before so you have to have mentors person that have done it before that can guide you along the way so what i do is that i always uh, from the beginning from the set go i choose some channel and i actually watch these channel and learn from them but how do you actually do it you're going to select about five channel that is in your niche that you can learn from don't select channels that are very big because 
they already have a community and anything they post will be watched so when your channel is actually big big it's like certain algorithm and other small stuff doesn't really affect your channel because you have a big community already and what you, you can get away with some of the curves so you don't want to to be following a channel that is too big because they can even post a video without no description no title nothing and the videos still get a million views because they have like crazy a crazy big community so you want um to look at channel that is not too far from you but above you and channels that are still growing and watch this channel look at what they do and what you want to do is to actually look what is working for them and look at what is not working for them and what you want to do is to reverse engineer all of that that they have on their channel onto your channel when i say reverse engineer i don't mean that you're going to copy the exact thing you're going to take their idea improve on it add things to it put your own thoughts to it your own little spin on it and actually see how it work on your channel so that is what you want to do surround yourself with positivity surround yourself with positive people so let me take one quick look in the chat and then i'll get back to the presentation let me see what you guys are seeing in the chat so in the house we have royan king what's up man how are you doing it's been a long time we haven't seen you what has been the improvement on your channel now are you uh, growing like crazy are you like 1 million subscriber ryan king let me know in the chat and of course we have shanice edwards in the chat um shanice we're glad to have you on the stream um guys you you can actually give shanice a shout out unless you feel welcome to the family Karjik, um shanice is actually a jamaican and she 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 loves beauty she likes the things that you like um Kari J is saying hi everyone welcome to the live stream say hi to everyone and thumbs up if you're enjoying the information that's cool Karji. um Karji is saying oh that's awesome maya what's your channel about um so ryan king is saying now nah, i'm 200 plus so ryan king um did you catch the first part of the presentation you, we're, we're actually going through the youtube um curve you, you got the first part of the, the presentation um, are you want me to when I'm finished present after the run treat back for you quick? Let me know in the chat. Guess who is in the house? Paper object is in the building. How are you doing, man? We're glad to have you, paper object. And um what we're seeing is now is saying, um re you remember guys to click the to keep the chat very clean because um some of my streams got demonetized because of things that you guys say, say in the chat. So keep the chat um family friendly or oh, Ryan King is saying yes I did so we're cool so I'm gonna finish the rest of the presentation and then I'm gonna have back in the chat with you guys and paper object is saying good um so let me actually jump back to the presentation finish it and then we will act actually hang out in the chat and make it very awesome so back to the presentation so I was at number two slide so let me actually start from the current slide and then I'm actually going to go right here so a number three slide, I, I have this for you guys. Develop a growth mindset. Forget about negativity. Tell yourself that if others have done it, I can do it too. If other persons have made it on YouTube, why you think you can't make it? You can also make it. You just need to figure this thing out. You just need to figure it out and to see exactly how to make it. If other persons have done it before, you can do it also. So what you want to do is that you want to try to reach out to other people in a nice way. Don't do it in a spammy way that like um, sub, sub, subscribe to my channel. Um, I just subscribed to your channel. So you should sub, can you sub back to my channel and those sub for sub stuff and post and link and the spammy way. That's not how you reach out to persons. Um, how you want to reach out to persons is, uh, is like how I have done it. So you go to person's community, you participate in the community, you add, you add value in the community. If they're keeping a, um, a live stream, you go onto the live stream, you add value, you interact with everybody there, and you, you actually become a part of the community. Once you do that, become a part of the community, you don't even have to tell a person to subscribe to your channel. They're going to start asking you about your channel and what is your channel about, and automatically they're going to start subscribing to your channel. 
and persons in my community here can as, can attest to that um i think Kari J may be able to attest to that so persons from my community start subscribing to her channel and she didn't ask them to subscribe and she didn't do it in a spammy way all she did was to join my community add value in the community participate in the community reach out to other persons see if they want to do a collaboration with you give them advice tips like that and and you will actually find that person will start subscribing to your channel and you start growing and they will teach you things behind the scene that they know that they're, they're not actually necessarily teaching on the youtube channel so that's how you want to reach out to other persons and i'm definitely telling you that reaching out to other persons will work ask questions ask them questions what they how they do things on the channel and how they get to where they are so far and stuff like that and if you're doing it in a nice genuine jamaican way people will actually reach out to you back ask for help guys don't be afraid to ask for help if you need something and you're not exactly know how to do it ask for help and i'm telling you that your channel will grow like crazy on this slide i want to share something else with you some persons from the beginning tell themselves that hey once they reach that plateau they said hey this is too hard for me i can't do it if you tell yourself that you can't do it marcus Garvey said if you have no confidence in yourself you are twice defeated in the race of life that is so true you have to tell yourself that you can do it marcus garvey quote if you have no confidence in yourself you are twice defeated in the race of life so i have some one more slide for you but i want to take a quick look in the chat and then i'll get back to the other slide i think i have about four or so more slides for you so let me see what you guys are saying in the chat i like the participation in the chat so we have Faxima. How are you doing, Faxima? Um, where are you? Where in the world are you watching from? It's the first time I'm seeing you in in my community. What is your channel about? Um, you're saying your son channel is Marsh Haitian, something like that. Welcome, and we're glad to have you in the live stream. Um, Rowan King is saying, I don't do that. I let people check me out, and I let my videos do the work. That's awesome. That's how you should do it. Karaji is saying, I totally agree with becoming a part of the community. It worked, definitely did work. Ma is saying, they block me from most live stream. A lot of Americans don't like people like me. Um, ma, you do, it might be you're doing it in a spammy way. Don't do it in a spammy way. Just do it the way how we tell you to do it and it'll definitely work. Karaji is saying, wow, Ma, it's because of what you do. Um, Karaji Live is also saying, amazing quote from Marcus Gavi. Yes um faxima is saying why you feel like that um um faxima is watching from new york so are you jamaican or do you know about jamaica you have anything to do with jamaica um, um faxima is saying not you so guys um remember to keep the questions in your mind and put them in the chat Cause as soon as i'm finished presenting i'll be jumping in the chat and to answer you guys question faxima um faxima what is your channel about um uh, let me know what is your channel about i would really like to take a look at your channel and give you a, give you some more in-depth tips on your channel as soon as i'm finished the presentation so guys i'm going to go back to the presentation and then i'm going to actually jump back in the chat with you guys and hang out for a while i'm going to go back to the presentation and see what you got um Finish the presentation, but just before I go, let me read this last um text from Faxima. He's saying, "My son is a Jamaican. I have a family." Okay, so your son is a Jamaican, and I am a Jamaican. Almost every person in the chat is a Jamaican. Um, where in Jamaica you're from, and what is the channel about? We like to give you some tips. When I'm finished with the presentation, I'll give you some tips. Almost everybody in the chat right now are Jamaican. I, I can see all Jamaicans in the chat. Um. All Jamaicans in the chat right now, just type the red J in the chat. Let us see all the persons that are Jamaican. So I'm going to head back to the presentation and then I'll get back to the chat. So what I have on my next slide for you guys, let me actually go from the current slide and then uh, bring up the next slide. No, not that one, this one. So number four slide, you want to teach what you already know. So I find that when you teach others, what you know already, you get better at doing it. So 
if you know something or you have some knowledge and you share it and you teach constantly teach it i find out that you get better doing uh, uh, i get better uh, um doing it or better at what you can do i don't know if you guys have the same experience let me know in the chat um you will you will also learn things from the persons you are teaching um and these are things that you don't really know so i learn things from my community i learn things from a lot of persons in my community i learn things from courage i learn things from a lot of my subscribers you ask them questions and they will actually teach you also so it's both way to work so you you can't be hey holding back i'm not teaching anybody anything i know what this information is for me alone you will not grow that way you want to teach persons everything you know share every little tip with them and they will actually share tips with you and, and it will actually work that way so try to teach persons what you already know already so if it's five persons if it's five subscribers you have treat them like it's five million and try to teach them everything that you know if if it is a community and your channel make sure that you all learn from each other make it to be very interactive so that is what i want to share with you guys on the fourth slide let me head on to the next slide some persons might be saying gear is their problem and the reason why they're not growing why they're hitting this plateau is because of the gear that they have i'm telling you that hey there's nothing such thing like that i can remember this girl um Kareji, you know who i'm talking you can put her name in the chat if you remember her name just now she actually did a video with her phone in the bathroom where it was like shaking and echoing and guess what the video get millions of views you know why because she was being herself and she was being real and she was just telling things as it is so right now don't worry about the equipment that you have if it's your phone you have just use your phone your phone can actually do the work and what you want to do is that you can start out with your phone or continue with your phone and over time you will acquire better camera drone etc so that's what i want to share with you and editing software i want to share that with you if you're on windows what i use is filmora and filmora for me is doing a very awesome job um Karaji, the, the the vlog that i did today do you like the music in the background how do you like the music um i use filmora to do that so filmora is very awesome if you guys watch my vlogs you can realize that filmora is what i used to edit them so if you're on windows you can use filmora if you're on your phone you can use on and if you're on an android phone i'm not sure about um like iphone and the rest of the phone you can use viva um i don't know i'm not sure if viva is available to all phones but i know it's available to android you can edit your videos on your phone and you can actually upload them to youtube and you can they can be awesome so that's what i want to share with you as it relating to editing software and just before i head back in the chat i want to share my top five secrets for youtube with you guys number one no number five the community participate in your community answer your subscriber question be a part of your community upload upload as often as you can thumbnail is a game changer seo title tags and description and watch time is the number one thing on youtube i actually did a live stream on it yesterday my top five secrets so if you guys missed out on that you can actually go and watch that live stream and you will learn everything there so now it's time for the questioning it's the q a section we are now at the q a section or the channel review um, section if you guys want me to review your channel think about your questions carefully put them in the chat and i'm more than happy to answer your questions i'm going to jump in the chat right now so let's see what's going on in the chat all right so in the chat um i'm going to pick up from um where where Karaji is saying i agree about the gear um she spoke about why i didn't marry my husband for love yes and it got millions of views um should I scroll up the chat a little bit? Let me see what's going on in the chat. A little bit. I'm going to scroll up a little bit. Let me actually close up one of this. Um, so, let me take the chat up a little bit. Alright, so so amazing code from Marcus Gavi. I passed that part. Let me scroll down um, just a bit. So, guys, I'm trying to catch up in the chat to see what you guys are talking about. Um, so, let me start from Crafter Crafter. Crafter Crafter is in the building. Sorry for being late. We accept you guys. Um, Karaji is saying hi Crafter Crafter. Foxy Mom is saying I love only one video but I would like to 
oh you you said i have only one video i would like to grow his channel i am from the us his channel is um martians so you want me to bring up your channel and give you a channel review let me know in the chat i upload a 40 minute video yesterday and i gained nine subs it will hopefully be my most viewed in the week i just happened to like your title and send it send it to him okay thanks for doing that craft to craft is saying i got over seven hours um watch time that's awesome so let me actually scroll the chat down and see if i can catch up with get you guys um got craft to craft is saying i gotta go to sleep that's what he's, he's saying so i'm trying to catch up with the chat i'll soon catch up with you guys i'm gonna actually skip out some of the chat so i can catch up with you guys and ask your questions answer your questions so um Moi is asking what is Filmora? Filmora is an editing software. Kaiji you answer that one already? Um, let me see which one. How to, to grow with SEO? Um, Foxy Max is asking about how to grow with SEO. Um, so I'm gonna answer the question. I'm gonna, so guys, I'm, I'm picking up the chat from here. So, Foxy Max, let me just pop open your channel just now so we can actually look at your channel. Just gonna pop open your channel just now, and then I'm, I'm gonna answer your question about SEO. So I'm actually going to your channel just now. You said you have one, like one video, but there are still some things you can do even if you have one video that will help your channel. So I'm opening up your channel. I'm opening up your channel just now. Um. So while that is loading, let me answer your question in the meantime. All right, so Foximax, SEO meaning search engine optimization. So YouTube is a search engine. It's in fact, the search is one of the biggest part of YouTube. So this is how it actually works. Somebody want to find out something on YouTube, they go into the search and they type in the search. YouTube will actually rank the videos based on the title of the video, the tags, and what is in the description. So your video will pop up. Then they might be look at the thumbnail and decide if they're going to watch your videos. So that is what SEO. A tool to help you with SEO is TubeBuddy. A link to TubeBuddy is in the description of this video. So um, that is actually the search engine optimization part. Um, Foximax is saying, yes, I would like that. Um, CarJ is saying, would you do a video on how to step-by-step -step SEO rundown? Yeah, I can. I could actually do a video on that and share with you guys. So I'm gonna actually take a look at um, Foxy Max channel, and I'm gonna give some recommendation. And I want you guys to let me know what you think about the recommendations in the chat. So I'm bringing up that channel just now. It should be complete the loading by this. So I can see that they have eight subscribers, but there's nothing on the channel trailer. So that's the first thing. All right. So let me actually show use my channel as an example to show you um, what I want to show you. So let me run through this real quick. Guys, um, put your questions in the chat. Any questions that you have, anything that you want to know, put them in the chat. But also I want you to comment on any recommendation that I might give. Um, for this person, Foxy Mom, is that is that name Foxy Mom or Foxy Ma? Um, let me know in the chat. All right, so I'm waiting for this to load up. All right, so this is what we have now. So, um, Foxy Ma, what you want to do is that um. You want, let me know if you guys are watching. Who are the persons that are still watching? Let me know in the chat if you guys are still here with me and if you're still watching. So, Foxy Max, this is what you want your channel trailer to be like. I'm not, not your channel trailer, your channel art. So, you want to have a channel art. Now, on your channel art, you want something to be um, clear. You, you want your channel art to pitch certain values. So, the first thing you want your channel art to do is to have a picture of you on it. And I give you a... a, a a good mark for that because you actually have a picture here so that's a good thing because persons connect with 
persons and not connect with icon. Some YouTubers like to put icon. Persons don't connect to icon, they connect to human. So you want to have that right here. And I can see that you have that right here. So that's good. But you need to have some more things. You need to actually create a channel trailer. Now I'm keep on saying channel trailer. You need to create a channel art. So on your channel art, this is what you need to have. What is your channel about or what is your belief system? So on my channel, I have knowledge is power. We, we empower you all. And then I have marketing and tech tips. So I'm telling you what the channel is about. And I have when I upload. Monday, Thursday, Saturday at 8 p.m. EST time. So you want to have all of that on your channel trailer. So that's the first thing you want to do. Let me know down in the chat if you if you understand what I'm saying. So um Moy is saying fix the tags on the video at Foxy. Um Foxy, are you still in the chat? Um We have some um um Foxy saying nickname, I'm here. So what are the persons that are still here? Um Viral freebies saying how much are you making on YouTube? Um, I would have to check that. Guess who is in the house? I haven't seen this subscriber for a very, very long time. Chad is in the building. How are you doing, Chad? It's been a long time. We haven't seen you on the live stream. How are you doing? Are you okay? We have some other persons joining. Is this an invasion? Um con infinity consciousness is also in the building. On I'm not going um guys free um freebies I want you to keep the chat as clean as possible because I don't want my live stream to actually be demonetized a lot of my live stream have been demonetizing because of the chat so guys I want you to keep the chat as clean as possible um chat is saying I'm good how about you we're, we're good here man um infinity saints thanks for the shout out so I'm gonna actually finish with the um the review of Paximax channel and then I'll head back in the chat and talk to you guys. Um chat design is saying can you review me please? Most definitely I'll review you chat design as soon as I'm finished with um as soon as I'm finished with Faximax. So let me actually finish up with Faximax and then I'll do chat designs. So guys, tell me what you think about the recommendation that I gave to Faximax for the channel um, art. Faximax, what you also do is that you want to actually customize the layout of your channel. I can see that the, 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 the layout of your channel is not customized. So how you actually do that, let me show you. So you go to the old design in YouTube. I'm not sure exactly where the button is in the new, in the new design. What you want to do is to click right here where you have this gear button. So you click on it. And when you click on it, you get this option that said customize the layout of your channel what you want to do is to turn it on it says recommended for people who upload videos regularly add a channel trailer suggest content for your subscriber and organize all your videos and playlists into sections so you you definitely want to be doing that so when you do that this is what the layout of your channel will look like so if you notice um I have, when persons come to my channel for the first time i have content there that i can actually suggest to them so because i put the content in playlists and add it to the front of the channel in sections so you definitely want to do that also uh, foxy max another thing that you want to do is that you want to create a video that is is a replica of your channel trailer so what we call a replica of your channel art so what we call that video is a channel trailer so it's like a short one minute video that persons will actually see when they come to your channel for the first time telling you what the channel is about so tell me if you'd actually get the channel trailer when you came to my channel for the first time so you definitely want to do that. So I talked to you about the channel art, the channel trailer, the layout of your channel. Let me actually look at the description of your channel and see. Well, there's they won't, they're not going to be in the description or anything like that. So when you actually layout your channel properly, then you'll have all of this stuff display on the front. Playlists, um, channels, um, discussion, and all that stuff. So those are my quick tips for you, um, Faxim Simam. So you can actually make those changes to the channel and then I can give you further tips. So let me jump in the chat to see what you guys are saying. And then I'm going to look at Chad's channel. So in the chat, we have um we have no late late um let me see what you guys are saying in the chat. Foxy Mom is saying, what about watching how 
well other niche are doing well well as i said before you can actually look at other channels that are similar to your own and actually um re reverse engineer stuff from their channel Kari J is saying canva is great for thumbnails and photojet is also great for thumbnails but i use photoshop no photoshop is for computer um, I, I don't think photoshop work on phones chat design um ah really chat i got to try that out um what chat design is saying there's a photoshop photoshop touch oh photoshop touch is for phone okay i got that chat design is saying hello if you have an engine go to my channel and look at a video call what are engines is need up why is in the description okay he's sending you to check out the video it's hard fixing the banner for me it's easy to fix the banner um Moya. um foxy max is saying the martians chat design is saying i have it on my phone okay most definitely so chat design i'll be looking at your channel now to see what improvement you have made since the last time i, re I review your channel so let us actually bring up your channel and see what you have been going on with if you're actually making any improvements on your channel and you guys can tell me what you think about his channel and we're going to actually give him a grade it's going to actually be a so since it's the second time i'm reviewing your channel i'm going to actually give you a grade i'm going to actually give you a, a b c d or e or f so i'm actually loading your channel just now so let me see you while that is loading let me see what you guys are seeing in the chat so what are the persons we have watching here now still we have Kari J, we have chads guys i like when you keep the chat rolling um thumbs up the video everyone the live stream yes guys you definitely give need to give the live stream a thumbs up i'm not seeing a thumbs up on the i'm not seeing i'm not sure if everybody have given the live stream a thumbs up i would like you to give the live stream thumbs up so um foxy mom is saying that's the one i'm looking to grow um so your channel should be up now so let me actually see what your channel look like so you have made some improvement you are like 129 subscribers now and you you, you have awesome um channel art well not exactly awesome because some things are missing from it you even have a channel trailer now what you're taking the tips man you're actually learning so i'm gonna sub you and, and bring you to 139 just now i'm waiting for your channel to finish load up then i'm gonna sub you bring you to 139 and tell you some things that you need to actually change so i'm just waiting for it to load properly i actually saw you already let me turn on the bell notification um so that's loading so i'm turning on the bell notification all right so i'm waiting for your channel trailer to load but it's not loading it's taking a very long time to load your channel trailer sound very noisy i'm not sure what is in your channel trailer so i'm not going to play it now because i don't want my live stream to be demonetized but so far i think you need to put a picture of your face right here because people connect with people and not humans so that's a recommendation for you right here um can you make these words bigger up here that said official what is that official channel of channel design be sure to subscribe um i'm on my computer and it's hard to read so what if it's that someone is on a phone it's going to be more difficult to read so you need to actually make these texts a little bit bigger and you need to tell when you upload more content on your channel so those are the tips for you on your channel trailer but it's good that you actually have a channel 
um, art now and that you also have a channel trailer and you actually have your channel layout properly so you, you're you're actually making advancement and i can see that you have passed the 1000 the 100 subscriber on youtube only about 6 million channel past that of the 17 million channel on youtube so you're definitely getting there um i'm gonna actually look at your description what you're saying in the description and your thumbnails and other stuff like that and give you some more tips but let me check in the chat to see what you guys are saying um Foxy Max is saying um is telling us about this channel um kaiju is saying oh i like the music in the background of your vlog mackenzie um thanks for that and i like chad channel art yes i definitely like it too the person that like chad, chad channel art let me know in the chat who are the person that are still with us Foxy Max, crafty craft are you still in the building who are the persons that are still in the building? More, what do you think about um, Chad's um, channel art? Alright, so let me actually finish with your channel review, Chad. Um, so I'll head back over. So let me see what you have in the description. I'm interested to see what you have in the description. And then I'm going to actually look at your thumbnails. Oh, you let me down in the description, man. You have, hey, I am a free GFX designer who does graphics for free. I do banners, headers, logos, um, AVI, and inches. You need to have some more information, man. How persons can reach you, email you, and all those stuff. So, Moya, here's a guy that can do a channel art for you for free. He's actually in England. Chad, Chad you are in England, right? Or you can actually show you how to do one. Chad, let me show you what you what want you to do with the about section. Let me actually show you. Um, what I want you to do in the about section is that I want you to use up the first city three characters by telling them what your channel is about. So I, I see where you actually been do, do that. But you want to go on further to, to, to giving them more information about your channel. Or you want to actually put an email address right there that person can contact you for like business or any other important information and if you have any links you want to put them down there so you want to take full advantage of the description section like how you see i do it let me know if you agree with that in the chat um guys let me know if you agree with that in the chat um so Foxy is saying Martian's channel. Um, Foxy, when I'm not understanding what you, you're saying, the, you, the channel that I look at, Foxima, isn't that your son's channel? Or you're saying that there is another channel for your son that named Martians? Let us know in the chat and let it be clear so we can understand properly. Um, chat designer saying I'm writing down I'm writing stuff down so that's why I'm not in the chat um so you're actually taking notes um chat design that's cool that that's good that you're taking notes Fox mom is saying I am waiting to learn more before I start uploading every day well you're actually at the right channel you will learn a tons of things here Kai J can tell you that Sometimes I'm lazy with description, but it's it's so important. Karji, what you need to do is that you need to um you need to actually use TubeBuddy and write a description one time and when you upload your video, you just click one button and the description is there. That's what you need to do. So anything you need to change is just say the top part of the description. Um Foximap is saying my son, okay, we got you now. So chat design, let me look at your thumbnails and then we're going to finish up with your channel. So I've looked at, um, I'm going to look at the videos now and then let's see what, what thumbnails you have in your channel. And then I'm going to finish up with your channel.
I'm actually waiting for your videos section to load. So as soon as that load, I will look at the thumbnails. Let me see what you guys are saying in chat. Any questions you guys have in the meantime in the chat? Anything you want to ask? Anything you want to add to the conversation? Um, we're actually streaming for almost an hour, hour now. And I'm not going to go too much over an hour. So guys, you want, any questions you have, you want to put them, in, put them in the chat. So I can answer your questions really quick. And stuff like that. The reason why I'm not making the, the live stream more than an hour or just a little bit over an hour um, because um, I want the experience to be awesome for the persons that are watching the replay. Um, Car J saying, really Mackenzie? I didn't know that. I'm exploring that. Sorry to hear that, Moya. Car J, every time I'm uploading a video, all I put in the video is the title and the tags. My description is there and it is set. Only thing I change in the description is um is that I put the the thumbnail I put the title in the first part of the description. But the description is just gonna be there, it's gonna be set. I think I can show you how to do it if you're not getting sure how to do it. Or I can do a dedicate I can do a short video on it and upload it to let you see. So let me actually look at Chad's thumbnail and then I'll head back in the chat and then we're gonna finish up the live stream. Um so this guy is learning fast. He he's actually learning a lot of stuff. Um is it that you're going live? You doing live stream a lot? I see where you have live, 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 live. They all look the same. Um so from the last time I reviewed your channel, you're actually learn a lot. But there are some things that you need to change as it relates to these thumbnail. So Number one, you need to have something branding going on at the thumbnails. Something that persons will know anywhere they see it, that it is your thumbnail. Some little logo or something. I don't see where you have that going. Number two tip for thumbnail is that you want to get some face in it. Somewhere in it you want to get your face. So persons can recognize that it is your thumbnail. And for thumbnails, I've learned recently that you don't need too much text on the thumbnail. Too much text is not good. Less is best. So you need to have less text and more imagery. And any imagery that you're focusing on, you need to make it pop out. Um, so let me give you, let me show you an example of a... I'm not liking this thumbnail. Let me show you an example of a good thumbnail. Um, show you an example of a good thumbnail. Um... Let me actually bring this down and um, bring up this to show you a good example of a thumbnail. And then I'm going to show you some, some thumbnails on my channel. Um, so this is an example of a good thumbnail. So if you notice right here, I have my face in it. I have the logo going right here. And I have just one screenshot of what the video is about. But um, for thumbnails, let me show you. For thumbnails, you want to make sure your face is in the thumbnail. Less is best. The less screenshot you have, etc., you have in your thumbnail is better. Don't put too much text. Put a visual logo on your thumbnail. Let me actually show you how I'm actually have been doing my thumbnails. Um, so I want to go to videos right here. Show you what I'm doing with my thumbnails. So you know that's loading. Let me jump in the chat and see what you guys are saying. Um. Moya, they're saying that you should actually create another account or you, should, you, got, you have to wait out the period. Um, you can actually wait out the period and actually see what's going on. Um, Moya, remember I said to keep the chat clean. I see where Kariji, um deleted a message or something like that. What's going on in the chat? Guys, keep the chat clean. Yeah, hopefully... They don't delete me. Um, Maya is saying, Karaj at Foxy. You don't want another account, Maya. I, I, I already lost one channel due to strikes. Um, Maya, you just, you just have to learn. You just have to learn how YouTube operates and actually stay within the rules if you want to be on YouTube. 
and if you want your channel to actually grow um um foxy max is asking what are persons doing to get tons of views what you do to get tons of views is that you actually follow youtube best, best practice make good videos me and post them um onto your youtube channel and you actually get good views no there is not an app for tubebuddy you have to access tubebuddy on, on a computer um Foxy Max. No, we don't pay to get views. We get views organic, organic, um, organic, not gonna, organic. We don't pay for views. Um, Chad, I'm actually loading my channel to show you what I'm talking about as it relates to the thumbnails. But it's taking a little time to load. I'm not sure if there's a slowdown with the internet. Let me actually close some things out. So let me close this out. See if it will actually load a little bit faster. I'm not seeing anything in the in the chat. Are you guys still with still with us? Are you still here? Who are the persons that are still here? So Veron Somerville is in the building. I'm here, bro. Just actually teaching some of my subscribers some stuff, hanging out with them on the live stream how are you doing man are you good where, where in the world are you are you in jamaica are you actually overseas so chad i want to bring this up to show you all right so chad here we go so i want you to look at my thumbnails and see what i'm doing i actually show you what is a good example of a thumbnail already but I want to show you some more stuff like what I'm doing at my thumbnails. If you notice, on my thumbnails, they all look the same with the branding feature and all that. But I feel like with some of my thumbnails, I have too much text on it. So I'm exploring something now. But you notice I always try to have my face in all of my thumbnails. If you notice, my face is in my thumbnail. Because as I tell you before, persons click on thumbnails more that have face in them. But I also feel that I'm having too much text on my thumbnail. And it, I think the text gives persons too much brain, too much work to read. And they know they just don't bother click. So look what I'm doing most recently now. I'm getting rid of all those lot of text. So notice this thumbnail. No text on it. Got like 196 views already. This thumbnail, I feel like it has too much text. I'm going to redo it. Um... Let me show you a good example. Notice this thumbnail. I don't bother to put any text in it. Just the image of me showing how to vlog. So you want to get the imagery in it, but not too much text on it. Notice this thumbnail. I have a few texts on it. This one that I did that you guys are watching now, little or no text. This one, little text. So you don't want to have too much um, text on your thumbnails, but you want to have the icon that link all of your thumbnails. You want to have your face in it and you want to let them pop. So tell me what you guys think about my thumbnails and stuff like that. I think this thumbnail might have too much text. So I'm learning the, the, the graphics thing also, and I'm learning about thumbnails, but that those are my tips for, for you as it relates to thumbnails. Um, you want to ensure that you have good thumbnails because thumb persons um we all read book by the cover right but thumbnails is what persons will read your video by and click on it so in the chat let me know um chad are right, chad are you still in the chat what person that are still in the chat kaiji are you still in the chat we have about um a few minutes before end the chat yeah I'm, I'm about to end the live stream also because i've been going for like one hour and what at five minutes so chat that's all those are the stuff that i have for you as it relates to thumbnail and how you can be improve your thumbnail any other final thoughts any other final questions that you guys want to put in the chat any any other thing real quick let me know carry just saying i'm here i'm about to leave for bed I'm about to, live to end the live stream also. 
Um, Veron Somerville, my schoolmate, is saying, Yeah, man, my good overseas. Where where overseas are you? Let me know in the chat. Karjay is saying, Have a good one, everyone. It was a pleasure meeting you all, I hope, and I wish to see you all tomorrow, same time. All the best, everyone. So, yes, I hope to see you guys here on the live stream, same time tomorrow. And Foxmark is, is saying, This is a great night. Yeah, we, 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 Glad to have you in the family and we're glad to have you joining. We hope to see you tomorrow for another live stream. Moi is saying good night at Kari J. Fox is saying nice. I'm I'm going to subscribe. You you definitely need to. And Veron Somerville is saying I'm in New York. Okay, cool man. Veron Somerville, have you subscribed already? And I want you to subscribe to the, the live stream and give it a thumbs up, bro. And stuff like that. We're here doing the work, you know. Um, any other final thoughts? Any other thing you guys want to say? Some of it, you need to join the stream. You can join the stream a little bit earlier. I go live just about 8.30 to 9. Every day, almost every day, I'm going live. I'm doing live. So, we will catch you tomorrow on a I stream like for a hope, one hour there about. So, any other final thoughts, guys, just before we end the live stream? Let me know in the chat. Anything you want to add? Anything you want to ask? Anything? If there's nothing else that you guys want to add or you want to ask, um, I'm going to thank you all for joining in the live stream. And we had an awesome live stream. Thank you for participating. And I will see you guys tomorrow with another live stream. Thank you all for watching. Foxy Max is asking, what time is it in New York? I'm not sure. I think they are one one hour ahead of us. I think it might be eleven thirty there. It's ten twenty in Jamaica. So I'm gonna end the live stream now. If there's nothing else.